just staying with uh, United because the share price on the New York Stock Exchange rose by around 16 percent to almost $15 by the time trading had closed yesterday. So that is the highest closing price since last December and added over £330 million to the club's value. United are already one of the world's most valuable football teams. According to Forbes earlier this year, the club was worth £3.9 billion. Only Real Madrid and Barcelona were valued higher. Well, as we've heard, the sale of Manchester United would be the second major takeover of a Premier League club this year. It's after a consortium led by that man, Todd Burley, bought Chelsea for a record value of £2.5 billion plus extras in the summer. Manchester United have appointed the Rain Group, who were used by Roman Abramovich to sell Chelsea to, to try to oversee the, the potential interest and sale. Um, Ch Chelsea are a, a big club. Manchester United's a bigger club. There's no doubt about that. So I think we can see interest, first of all, from the States. Uh, lots of private equity companies feel that, uh, that the, the football and the Premier League in particular is undervalued. And secondly, um, you know, we, if we have a successful World Cup in the Middle East, um, whilst we've already got interest in football from Abu Dhabi, Qatar and Saudi Arabia, there's other Middle Eastern areas or uh, potential investors who might decide on the back of what's happened in Qatar and also the success of the other Middle East owners that they might be uh, interested in acquiring Manchester United as well.